So is Alvin Kamara actually sucking me back into the circle of trust for 2024 fantasy football? It's the Fantasy Sports Plus. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. So Alvin Kamara is a really interesting case. Right? Now, you know my rule. I do not draft running backs um, that are, you know, 28 years and older. And uh, Kamara certainly fits that that age bracket as he's now 29 years old. And, you know, each of the last three seasons, his numbers have been, have been declining. Uh, his broken tackle rate continues to slip. He rushed for the fewest amount of yardage per game, slightly over 50 yards last season, than he did since 2017. So that is a, a pretty stark drop. And also, his rushing average is the last three years. 3.7 in 2021, 4 uh, even in 2022, and 3.9 um, last season. So, you know, those are just not good numbers in terms of running the ball. But when it comes to Kamar, we all know it really comes down to the receptions. And on that front, he is as good as any running back in fantasy football. As a matter of fact, only Brees Hall was targeted at a higher rate than Alvin Kamara was last season. And Kamara, 75 catches, 466 yards, and a touchdown. Uh, in 2022, 57 catches. 2021, 47 catches. So I know he's, he's had some off the field trouble, was suspended for the beginning of the season. That actually makes it even more remarkable. The fact that he caught 75 passes in 13 games last year is unbelievable. And he has the perfect quarterback, a Derek Carr, in terms of continuing that trend because Carr loves to dump off to his running backs. Remember, Josh Jacobs caught all those passes with the Raiders and Derek Carr's last season there. Now Alvin Kamara is, is uh, taking advantage of that as well in New Orleans. And and here's the here's the the possible clincher for me. Right now, Kamara is going as running back 17, and that's, there's no suspension. He's he's still the guy. Uh, I know Kendry Miller is like a popular late round sleeper, and I get it. You know he's a dynamic back uh, who has potential. Really was injured a lot last year, and Kamara is slipping as a runner. But Kamara is going to get fed a lot in terms of the pass receptions. Kamara is going to continue to check it down. You can't throw the ball down the field. So I'm actually back open on Kamara as you know in that running back 17 range. I'm not going to reach for him, but of course PPR leagues. He certainly has a lot of strength there. And, and that whole tier, like Kamara is around David Montgomery. He's around Ramadre Stevenson. Like that's a good Zamir White. That group right there, if you can get, uh, you know, a back from that from that tier as you're running back two, like that's a really good thing. Uh, you know, you get a running back one before that. And then if you can get a running back two among those four that I just mentioned, um, I you know, Zamir White continues to be underappreciated. I think that uh, that's a winning strategy there. So I'm back in on Kamara. If the price is right, I won't chase him. But it's really more for the receiving part than the running part. Let me know what you think about Kamara. Post in the comments. More videos coming soon.